Tonight at five, grocery stores are feeling the pinch to compete against not only big box stores, but also full service restaurants. ABC 15's Angie Cayley is at the newest Fry's Marketplace near 13th Street in Bell with how that company is trying to convince you to walk through the doors. It has a wine bar, a sushi bar, and this outdoor seating. The newest Fry's is only about two weeks away from opening day. This is where our sushi and Pan Asia uh, areas will be. Fry's Marketplace manager Sally Angulo says there's something inherently special about your neighborhood grocery store. You come to the grocery store when you get off work, you might have had a bad day, and you see that smiling face of that associate behind there and they say hello to you and it just really makes their day. Angulo staff is in the last stages of training anticipating the upcoming grand opening celebration. With dozens of bustling workers and yards of empty coolers, it looks like they're behind, but they're not. As far as anything fresh, we'll be having it in the cases I believe the night before. The landscape of the supermarket industry as a whole has changed. This is Burry's cheese. From adding cheese and wine bars to drop in health clinics, they're forced to find ways to stand out from the crowd. Husband and a wife will come shopping. Sometimes the husband doesn't want to finish walking around the store, so he'll sit and maybe have a glass of wine while he's waiting. Plus, many shoppers are big on technology, but short on time. According to research by Nielsen, a quarter of those surveyed say they grocery shop online. Clicklist, it will be a big hit. Call the number and they come and deliver it to you right to the car. You don't even have to get out. The grand opening is July 15th. If you want more information, go to our website, abc15.com. In Phoenix, Angie Cayley, ABC 15 News.